We are back, man, and it's Throwback Thursdays once again. And we have three new Onyx cards today, man. We got Petrovic, Darnell Dawkins, and the GOAT, Jason Kidd. And Jason Kidd finally in 2K, man. I feel like we've been waiting for this card for a long ass time. Been waiting for him in Brandon Roy 2K. Let's get him in the game too. So shooting stats looking pretty solid, man. Pretty much low to mid 80s. And what's that driving layup looking like? 97. All right, we know the passing is going to be 99. Don't really even need to look. On ball defense, though, 99. Want to see that steal in pass perception, man. So this card honestly reminds me a lot of the CP3 we just got with the steal. He can shoot pretty much do everything. And now we got Draza, man, one of the best shooters of all time. Reggie Miller, man, when he talks about this guy, says he's probably the best shooter he has ever seen. So mainly just going to be more of the shooting type of guy. Nothing else really too special about this card, to be honest. But if you need a spot-up shooter, a dude who can stand in the corner, pick up this dude. But I am so happy. Hype for this Jason Kidd card, man. Him and Steve Nash, favorite point guards of all... Wow, David Lee Buns. But him and Steve Nash, my favorite point guards of all time, man. They are just so much fun to watch. They did... I mean, oh, oh my goodness. Give me the Onyx Paul Pierce for once. I honestly pull Paul Pierce and Darren Williams so much to not get their Onyx card, man. It is ridiculous. And it's not like either one of those Onyx cards are... Oh, I think Darren Williams' Onyx is maybe 5K. It's not overly expensive. It's not like... I need to get it, man. It's so beast, but I just want to pull it just so I can say I finally pulled them. But let me know down below in the comments, guys, who are your two favorite point guards of all time, man? Because I'm sticking with Steve Nash, man, in this Jason Kidd all time, man. No one's going to jump him. Both just so much fun to watch. Because and, and no lie, man, what made him even more fun to watch, they both had a sick running mate man because Steve Nash and Amari Stoudemire were absolutely filthy together and then Jason Kidd and Vince Carter man that, I mean, that's why they were so much fun just because they also had that another explosive player which I think kind of made them a little bit better to watch as our Onyx packs are kind of looking dry today man but last pack opening I think it was like our last like two packs we got that Willis Reed and Ennis Cancer come on Onyx packs man that's what's annoying every time I hear someone, they tweet me a picture, they pulled the Beast Onyx card, they say it was like in their first one or two packs, and I'm out here, I can't even get Andre Miller anymore, man, I'm still just getting these silvers. But you guys gotta let me know down below in the comments, man, what are you pulling today out of Onyx packs, and how much did you spend? Do you guys even bother opening Onyx pack? God damn, though. I mean, because honestly, these packs... For the most part, I think you lose a good amount of MT unless you can pull one of those elite, elite players. And even so, man, ever since last week, prices have been dropping like crazy, man. Out of nowhere, I mean, Kobe two weeks ago was five, almost 600K. And now he's, what, around 300? I mean, the auction house just, boom, out of nowhere, everything got cut in half. And I think it's because, but yes, let's go, Kyrie. Okay, on the right track is... No lie, can we please get an upgraded version of Kyrie after his playoff performances? And two, man, if you've been watching my NBA Live pack openings, they have the first round play. They, the, the first round my players started, they had upgraded versions of every card, man. I, I would love to see 2K do something like Kobe. Okay, man. So we're getting hot. We got two bag to bag golds. Now we just need to get this Onyx card up in here. I'm feeling this pack right here, man. I am feeling it. I do not know why. It's just calling me. We got bag to bag golds. I'm feeling the Onyx out here. I'm feel Damn it, though. No. Damn it, man. Come on, at least Andrew Wiggins. Oh, I really want to see a beast mode Wiggins because we get the Emerald. I believe he's an 84 overall, but damn, it'd be, it'd be sick, man, if we got some reward cards because, again, on NBA Live, they released a Lou Williams because he just won six. Man. Let's go. But we are getting this Onyx card. Finally, I told you guys, man, I was just feeling it. And I believe it is time, man, for us to pull a straight up beast. Let it be this Jason Kidd up in here. And it's Paul Pierce, though. Let's go, baby. Finally, man, my Onyx packs are heating up the past three weeks, man. I've got some pretty beastly pulls. So getting Paul Pierce the truth. So not quite the Jason Kidd we were hoping for, man. But definitely no complaints and no lie, man. Every time I look at this card, I feel like they did this card so dirty, man. He's top 20 in steals all time. And I'm sure his steal on this card isn't that great and i believe he's like what top 20 maybe 30 in points all time and to only be an 89 overall it's kind of just disrespectful and yeah his steal for being top 20 steals all time man i mean 67 steal come on now 2k and i believe too we are getting new dunk packs tomorrow and i i heard 
that we're getting the Raptors Vince Carter up in there. That would be absolutely filthy, man. If we could get the Raptors Vince Carter, but I do not know who else is going to be in there. Probably Dr. J, but he already has a 99 card with like a 99 dunking. So I'm really not going to be. Oh, let's go though. Steph Curry. Can we please 2K get an MVP Curry slash James Harden? Whoever wins it, man. But like that, I, I really wish, man, after playing live the past couple days, they add award winners like Lou Williams just got a card. Kawhi Leonard's about to get a new card because he won Defensive Player of the Year. We need 2K to get more current day, em em you know, more Emerald cards, man. I absolutely hate that about 2K. We, we get throwbacks every week, but we never get, you know, current day upgrades. And that's the card that I honestly want the most. Are these current day upgraded cards like nightly award winners? Something like that, man. I feel like 2K really sleeping on these current day players. In two, man, let me know down below in the comments if they could add one Onyx card into 2K. Who would you guys pick, man? Because me, Brandon Roy, all day, every day, now that Jason Kidd is in the game. But I'd love to hear if you guys think needs to be in these Onyx packs in. Ah, I couldn't clutch it out. Damn it, man. We couldn't end it on an Onyx. But damn, we got Paul Pierce, the truth today, man. Definitely no complaints from me. And hit that like button for me, guys, if you want to see some more pack openings. Subscribe if you're new, and I will catch you guys next time.